It's one of the most diverse and colourful communities in Canberra. With a celebrated composition of faiths, cultures and cuisines. You read the next one, Adam? But the depth of that diversity is not without its challenges, especially for younger, new arrivals. Multicultural hub Canberra offers a range of solutions via Gunners Place, a new space for young people in the area. I think the Homework Club is one of these wonderful ideas that uh, our organisation has about helping young people to actually catch up with your studies and it's something we couldn't do without the help of our volunteers. And which year are we going to use in that one? These children gather on Saturdays for extra English lessons. I think there's a bit of a gap um, unfortunately when it comes to education in the ACT regarding um, immigrants and refugees and people who don't get that sort of um, upbringing through like maybe preschool or kindergarten and whatnot. There's a gap that needs to be bridged so I think it helps doing this. Artist Kirindeep Grewal is also working hard to help newcomers to Gungahlin. What we are doing is batik painting and this is from uh, traditional art from Africa. She brings these women together every Tuesday for global art workshops. It's like you belong to the world here yeah, because I come across so many different cultures and so many different languages happening here. The diverse group creates beautiful pieces of work and binding friendships. More than sisterhood, I would say, the way they connect with each other, the way they respond to each other. And it's, for me, it's just a beautiful, beautiful thing to see. This cricket competition held every Sunday is helping forge equally strong connections. In this comp, the team members are from India, Pakistan, Nepal, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka and today one Aussie guy is playing for Gymkhana as well. Sanjay and Jasmine founded their not-for-profit sports association about eight years ago to help bring Gungalan's cricket lovers and their families together. All the time try to bring community together. They share their feelings, they share their culture, they share their food. And yeah, that's, that's the main idea behind it. Yes. Even at the height of COVID restrictions, the sport didn't stop. <laughs> now they're offering cricket coaching clinics for women and girls. If you teach a mother, you are teaching entire generation. So if you involve mum, if mum's happy, then the generation's happy. But is it crazy to expect cricket to be played in Canberra's freezing winter? <laughs> From my perspective, it's fun. It's fun. I love it. On the other hand... I uh, think so. I think it's crazy. <laughs> Only crazy people can do that. Crazy, perhaps. But also committed to this diverse and growing community. Sarah Porter, ABC News, Canberra.